The Great Chatsworth train wreck was a major rail accident that occurred on midnight of August 10, 1887, three miles east of Chatsworth, Illinois. The summer of 1887 had been hot and dry. Fearing that sparks from the steam engines could ignite brush fires, the TPNW company began performing controlled burns along its railroad tracks. Earlier that day, TPNW crews had performed a controlled burn near the site of the accident. It is suspected that failure to extinguish the fire resulted in charring of the trestle. Later that evening a TPNW train carrying vacationers taking advantage of a special offer to visit Niagara Falls had picked up passengers all along the TPNW line as far back as Iowa and left Peoria, Illinois around 8 p.m. Two steam engines pulled six fully loaded wooden passenger cars, six sleeper cars, and three luggage cars. It traveled east through Eureka and Chenoa and did not stop at Chatsworth. Just before the accident site, the train accelerated down a slope, reaching 40 miles per hour. The first engine successfully crossed the weakened bridge as it collapsed, the second engine crashed into the side of the hill, while each following passenger car telescoped into the next. The six sleeper cars attached to the rear of the train halted just short of the bridge. Of the 500 passengers about 85 perished and many more were injured. It remains to this day one of the deadliest train accidents in U.S. history.